Well, hello, and welcome back to the return of the Obra Dinn here on Buto Plays Whatever. In our previous episode, we were exploring the Soldiers of the Sea. And I think we got them mostly wrapped on up. I think there was like one more little part of it. Isn't that where we're at? The Soldiers of the Sea? No, no, no. We were we were heading towards uh, Kumi. Kumi on up. We were heading towards um, doo -doo 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 -doo, Unholy Captives. Right? Yes. Yes, that's where we're at. We must have wrapped up. Soldiers to see what the hell are we investigating then? The calling? Was it the calling we were on? It must be the calling. Yeah, okay. So we're on the calling. Wow, okay. We've been brisking through this. And we wrapped up here with all this calamity. Let's start it off. Bada bing, bada boom. So where's the. Oh, this guy. This guy died. Tell me about it. Got all these dead people. Really? We're just gonna... Okay. I'll say, t tell me about this here. I don't know what's going on. I imagine it's the next part, the calling, right? Where are you going, little buddy? Yes. Tell me about it. Ahoy! Well back. Here's the captain. Ahoy! The aboard. Wait! Don't shoot! I have treasure! I yield! Hold your fire! <laughs> oh, shit. Are we on the ocean? We are. Oh my god. Miss Slim. Oh god, the, the magical conch. So these are different fish people. You got shot by who? Oh, no kidding, huh? Second mate. Oh, okay, I'm not allowed to explain how he got shot. Interesting. Okay. Oh, and there's the jewel box. Wait, who's this? So is this the calling, I'm guessing? Okay. For some reason, I believe that, uh... Huh. The magic conch. No, he was shot. Mr. Nichols was shot. No, he was shot. But we don't know... who the attacker was just yet. Just yet. This might be able to piece it together. At least those, those, uh, those down below. Oh, because this is who we hauled up. Okay. And then he is. 
Mr. Nichols. Unknown enemy. Miss Lim was over here. Nipples. And there's Miss Lim. So what did Miss Lim die of? Is there anybody else out here I should know about? I don't see anybody. That doesn't mean anything. So it's not really telling me what this guy died of. Except that he was trying to save the magic conch. Which looks like it was bursting into flames? Hmm. I don't know who he is. And I don't know how he died. Like, he's been all over the place, but once we get one of these two dudes' identities, it's really going to start a ripple effect. Yeah, what's going on with this magic conch? Oh, how did we miss... Miss Slim? Miss Slim, tell me about yourself. Now, she was just right here. Right, they pulled them all up, dead. But what killed them? Were they poisoned? I mean, that's one of the few things we actually haven't gotten yet. Okay, Miss Lim. Tell me about yourself. I'm feeling poisoning. Holy crap. The magic conch. What the hell is going on here? Yeah, that's what's his name. I think I was speared. this guy did he get speared as well he did both these guys got speared it's not showing anything and then this guy got speared as well and this was mr. Nichols cower cowering <laughs> pretty hardcore so we got a couple spear deaths a lot of spear deaths what one two three miss Lim though I don't see I don't see what killed her just yet. She's very bloody. Which could be a number of things. Yeah, I don't know. I don't know what killed her just yet. Hagen, you're still breathing. So we got to know Hagen here. Who is this? Nichols is cowering, is cowering hardcore. No, I want this guy. So can I start putting some names to these? Some deaths to this? No. It'd have to be this guy. This has to be O'Hagan.
Um, Yeah, I don't know. That, that can't be O'Hagan. I imagine this guy's O'Hagan. Which is who exactly? So who's O'Hagan in this? O'Hagan. O'Hagan. Patrick O'Hagan. He's Ireland. Okay, so he's just a seaman. Okay. Keep rowing! Where is it? Where? Something there! I see it! Give us a weapon! Shoot it! My kid I! Pick up the oars and row, you fools! Oh God! Straight in the neck. So this guy is bang. Which is very nice. No, while well, we're here. So that's Mr. Lau. If the other guy was Bang, and this is the only guy that wasn't here, then he is Mr. Tan. So there's Miss Slim. She's tied up. Hey, this guy was definitely spiked. Exactly, see how he died. And he getting stabbed? And looks like he's gonna be drowned. This guy was spiked. Okay. That guy was spiked. No, not spiked. He was speared. By, um... Let's call him Enemy. I don't know who he is, though. He might be Mr. Hagen. I oh, know we're gonna have to start putting names and faces here after this is all said and done. So where are we... So this guy was speared. Course due east. You'll reach the Canaries in three days. You packed enough stores? Aye, sir. Checked and loaded them myself. Good. Stay quiet and alert. If the wind picks up, we've no chance against the Oberdin. Shoot ya! The one trouble! I shut it up! This is strange news! About monsters! I don't think it's so strange. And there's my e exit door, huh? So all these guys died just a horrible, horrible death, man. It's a horrible, horrible death. 
these mermaids. What's this door into nothingness over here? So that's how it all kind of st somewhat started. We're not getting why they're tied up though. Well, that guy got, definitely got speared. I mean, I think we established that they're just a foreign enemy. And yeah, now the door unlocks for me. But what killed Miss Lim? I didn't see exactly what killed her. Or what killed this guy? We'd have to backtrack it. Because it doesn't allow me to do it until the, the post scene. These weird enemies. Yeah, a lot of people died. Yeah, a lot of people died. A lot of people, those two guys, we don't know. The one looks like it got pulled overboard. But I swore, I swore he got, he got pulled over. I don't know. Tough call. What the hell? Boy, get in there somewhere. Storm coming. Finish your business and climb down here. What? No, my bit is because I've wrapped up everything. Okay, hold on here. Give me this save. Because once we go back, that unlocks. this uh, the bargain which is chapter 8 the doom no hold your horses the bargain so I don't know, do we try to solve as many people as possible before we head back down. I don't know. Like, cause he's got a chapter and it's gonna be of utmost importance. Are we gonna be able to get back on the boat? After we go to it back down there. And that's the thing. I don't know. I don't know. I mean, I mean we could look at all these all that we want, but we've gotten all the chapters except for the last one unlocked. And now it shows. No, I want. Give me, give me the queue. Give me the crew. So, basically everybody has been unlocked. Right? As far as my understanding goes now. Right? There shouldn't be anybody... We've seen, we've seen all that we could see. really not giving me a whole lot though
Yeah, this is all when they shot him. And you have to figure out who this guy is. <laughs> he must be just some sort of seaman. And this guy's been unlocked since the beginning. Don't know who the hell he is. So everybody's everybody's been unlocked. Okay. It's like I don't want to go down yet. I feel like we have to identify as much as possible. And that must be the magic conch. That's what it got taken back out to see. Interesting. So. Where the hell do we even begin? Do you even start at the very beginning? And we don't even know who that guy was that shot him. I don't know. I'm kind of at... Kind of at a loss where to start on that. To tell, to tell you all the truth. I mean, murder on the deck. Okay, give me the book. So, chapter one was loose cargo. Which was found on... This first part down here. Which is where, exactly? It's in the captain's cargo. Or it's in the uh, the cargo hole, which is the bottom. So let's start down there. Let's start it from the beginning of everything, and just see if we can't paint a little bit of a picture of this horrible, horrible, freaking tragedy. I don't even know if I would call it even a tragedy as much as I would just a sheer, just utter insan insanity of a trip. So, the first victim, the first true victim, was you, buddy? Part one of two. But now we should be able to put deaths to people. So this guy was crushed, and I'm fairly certain that it was one of the brothers, which is a Mr. Peters, the Peters brothers. I got a Nathan, and I got a Samuel Peters. He only has one memory, which was here being crushed. Now, was anybody else dead at this time? Nobody else was dead except for something was happening over here. And nothing really. Just had all these different people just kind of scurrying on around. So that was the first death. Now the second death
was over here on the captain's same spot, just a loose cargo. So this is where we're at? Okay, so we just have to head on over there. So same same spot, just up in the front bow of it. And we don't have a key for this. That'd make things a lot simpler. This guy. Oh, no, that's unholy captives. Keep pressure here. Hold him down. What madness is this? Twenty years, my steward, had never a doubt on your sanity. Explain yourself. Those ungodly beasts carry a curse. Throw them back or doom us all. Tie him up and put him in the lazarette with those things. He may yet find his senses. Come on. All's fine, John. Been in worse spots, I think. Where's the rest of his leg? So this guy bled out. And that's John Wilderall, the captain. So this... This guy down here. He died. He was... Um, Where's it on at? Strangled. He was torn apart by the surgeon's mate, Mr. James Wallace. Who he is, we don't know. But that dismemberment, dismemberment killed him. Now, it'd be really nice if I could get any sort of clue as to who else these guys are. Now this guy come out of here. He's the bassoon. And we don't know how he died. It never really did explain how he died. But this guy died dismembered by him on over there. So that's the first part of that clue. Okay, where's my exit? And then there's a disagreement going on over here between the artist. He's just trying to be held back right now. And these guys are coming on down to this chap. But that's all the death that we see thus far here. Oh, and here comes the brigade. Pull not on in. So is there anybody else? Anything I, uh, identifiable? Now this guy's death is up in the air. And this took place afterwards. Now this guy come out of here. Well, hello. This guy was spiked. What room are we on in? Give me... God damn it. Where are we at? Give me a cue. The ship. Where are we at? We're in the carpenter shop. So that guy's a carpenter. He is the carpenter. You, sir, are the carpenter. Winston Smith. And this must be your buddy. The carpenter's mate, Mr. Marcus Gibbs. If we're to, to presume things. Now, how did it say you died? 
He's speared by an enemy. By a foreign enemy. Which has been debatable if they're enemies or if they're just beasts. The same thing happened to you. He was spiked by a terrible beast. And who are you? Nothing, you're just just sitting pretty over here. So This Dunderhead, who we've still yet to identify, killed this guy. M Mr. William Watson. The cook, Thomas Sefton, struck by a tail, which was in the debatable category. So who's coming from where? Who are you? This guy was crunched by a cannon. This is the guy that was kind of down there. Okay. So is there anybody else coming from any specific spots? Like that's my question, is like if we can identify any locales these guys are coming from. Like you can presume these guys are, are, are cannon, cannon guys. I mean, for the most part. Now, is there anybody coming from anywhere other than that? Not really. But there was shit happening up here. Yeah, while well, that was going on, there was stuff happening. Yeah, all this horribleness. Who was this? Yeah, and this brought about this over here. Both of these guys spiked? Yes. He was spiked. By a terrible beast. This guy was also spiked, but we just don't know who he is. I don't know. Maybe this guy wasn't the cook. This guy's also wearing kind of a cookish clothes. I mean, did the cook have multiple people? Give me a tab. Give me the crew. So we have the cook and the butcher. This should be enough people. So we're, we're wrong about something here. So we're just, we're wrong about something here. Crushed by the beast, crushed, chubbed enemy. William Wasson, Seaman, India, clubbed by the enemy. Yeah, we don't know that enemy just yet. 
but we've painted a picture. For Mr. Chio Tan. Spiked by an enemy. Speared by an enemy. Mr. Marcus Gibbs. Mr. Tefton. Which I, I'm feeling is correct. Okay, Mr. Marcus Gibbs. The carpenter. <sighs> so maybe it's not an enemy. Maybe they're calling these guys beast. I mean, I would presume them to be more of a beast than... I mean, where's he at? By beast? Nope. So we can, we can... He was definitely speared, though. I don't know, but that's as much time as I got for today, ladies and gentlemen. <laughs> oh my god. My god. <clears throat> as much time as we got for today. And then this was this guy right over here. If you enjoyed today's episode, go ahead and leave a like, comment on below, subscribe, and subscribe when we come on back. We're going to keep trying to piece together most of this. Hopefully get a couple more names knocked off. I mean, we only got nine. We're like a fifth of the way through. And that's, that's just not, it's not going to cut the cake right now. So, yeah, that's going to wrap it up for today. So until next time, everybody, you take it easy. And I'll see you around. Peace.